In this movie, I will explain you how you can program a central function. First of all, I will start with this switch shutter actuator and I will search for a central function and in the general parameters I see central function for switching outputs and central function for blind outputs. So take a look at the objects. For the moment, there are no central function objects. When I click yes, you will find two uh, central traveling control central switching objects of one bit this is one for the shutters this is the other for the switching outputs because it is a combination of a switching and sh uh, shutter actuator so then i have to choose what is the reaction of the outputs when i send for example a zero to that object then it will switch off when i send a one then it will switch on the light. And the same for the blinds, for example, I can say when I send a zero, then the shutter will lower, and otherwise when I uh, receive a one to the central object, then the shutter will go up, but you can choose this. And then, very important, it's not because you already um, activated the central function for, the, for example, the switching objects, and in this case, I have um, output 1 and 2 for switching output and 3 and 4 together for one blind. And for example, output A1, I wanted to assign also to the central function because otherwise when I get here to no, for example also with the uh, A2, the second output it is no, this means that there wouldn't be any reaction even if I program it well. So, I will assign it now to the central function. This means also that you, for example, can choose for a central function not to activate or assign all outputs. For example, I have an output of 12, an actuator of 12 outputs, and with my central function, I want to use a one bit all switching output central switching object to activate, for example, all my outputs but I can choose which one. I don't have to take all the outputs. For example, when I have an actuator with 12 outputs, I can choose to send only to 10 outputs uh, a switching off or on a telegram, not telegram or a, a sign, a, a command, uh, even if I receive to the central object priority only one bit. So I receive one bit and it will send an on or an off to all outputs who are assigned to the central function. And for example, I will assign, assign now uh, both outputs. And both outputs now will react, go back, to uh, zero. Both will switch off or both will switch on when they receive a one. And then I, could do, I can do the same with the blinds. And I have to have a look to the um, to the central function, and yes, it's already assigned to the central function. So this means that the blind also will react. It's one blind. So uh, in general, when I receive, uh, let's have a look to the blind. When I receive a zero, it will go down. Otherwise, it will go up. Great. I will make a central function um, group address and I will put it in a group address. Also the all switching outputs, I will put them together so I can uh, send with one command of one bit, only one or a zero, I can command, I can command them both. And also, for example, for another actuator, another actuator, I have here um, two outputs, two outputs. And again, I have to look, can I activate the central function? For this moment in the group object there is no central function at all and then i will activate this i have to choose again uh, what's the reaction on a one and on a one or on a zero i will take this option and then again to the different channels i still have to activate them assign them to the central function for a1 and a2 for example i will leave this on no so only the A1 will receive a 1 or a 0 
uh, through the all switching output central switching function object of one bit. And then I have three central objects, only one bit, and that's the advantage to send with one bit, you can control several outputs of an actuator. And then I will take, for example, push button one, and I have to choose an output. I will take an output, for example, three, no function. I will choose for uh, switching. I can choose on or off or toggle on off. Then I have both. And then I can control those three uh, central objects with only one bu button of one bit. And that's an example of how to program a central function.